in 1988, a TV series hit the screens that would leave its mark on viewers across the nation. Empty Nest, a show centered around a widow with pediatrician and his life after his daughters leave the nest, strikes a chord with many. As you dive into the series, be prepared for a roller coaster of emotions from funny and shocking moments to ones that tug at your heartstrings. Ever found yourself wondering about a particular scene or moment from the show that stuck with you? Or perhaps you're intrigued by lesser known facts and anecdotes that add an extra layer of fascination to the series? Well, you're in for a treat. There's a plethora of funny, shocking, and even sad facts waiting to be unraveled, so keep watching. As you reminisce about your favorite episodes, we're curious what's your most cherished memory or personal experience related to the series? Share your stories and memories in the comments below. We'd love to hear from you. So get ready for a trip down memory lane filled with laughter, surprises, and heartfelt moments. Your empty nest journey has just begun, and there's a lot more in store. Let the nostalgia flow and the anecdotes unfold. The 1988 TV series, Empty Nest, follow with the life of a widow with pediatrician adjusting to an empty home after his daughters moved out. The show left a lasting impression on the cultural landscape, resonating with viewers nationwide. Its mix of humor, heartwarming moments, and surprises connected with audiences, creating a memorable viewing experience. As the series unfolded, it became a cultural touchstone, prompting viewers to reflect on their own family dynamics. The relatable story, along with memorable characters, created a connection beyond the screen, drawing viewers into the world of the show and evoking a range of emotions from laughter to poignant moments. Empty Nest's reception during its original run sparked a cultural phenomenon, leading to spin-offs that expanded the universe of beloved characters. These additions further solidified the show's place in television history, demonstrating its popularity. The impact of Empty Nest extended beyond TV with merchandise related to the series becoming sought-after items for devoted fans. The show's cultural influence persisted through subsequent generations. Adaptations and reimaginings enriched the Empty Nest legacy, inspiring creative endeavors and influencing storytelling and character dynamics in television. In conclusion, Empty Nest's impact on popular culture was undeniable. Its ability to evoke emotions, coupled with spin-offs, merchandise, and adaptations, makes it a timeless part of the cultural tapestry, continuing to captivate audiences. Let's explore the creative minds behind the 1988 TV series, Empty Nest. The show's inception owes much to its creators, Susan Harris and Paul Witt, who envisioned a narrative revolving around a widow with pediatrician navigating life in an empty home post his daughter's departure. Their collaboration gave birth to a cultural touchstone that resonated with audiences nationwide. Heading the production, the series had a skilled team of producers, including Tony Thomas and Susan Harris. Their collective expertise and creative vision steered the show into relatable storytelling, blending humor, heartwarming moments, and unexpected twists. The show's influence wasn't confined to the screen, it led to spin-offs that expanded the universe of beloved characters. Directing the series with finesse was Andrew D. Wayman, whose adept handling of the narrative ensured a seamless blend of comedic elements and poignant storytelling. Wayman's directorial skills significantly contributed to the show's lasting appeal. Now shifting focus to the cast, the main actors played pivotal roles in bringing the characters to life. Richard Mulligan, a seasoned actor, portrayed the widowwood pediatrician Dr. Harry Weston. Christy McNichol and Dinah Manoff took on the roles of his daughters, adding depth to the family dynamics. The chemistry between cast members infused the series with authenticity, drawing viewers into the Weston family's world. During the casting process, interesting trivia emerged. The meticulous selection of actors aimed not only at their acting skills, but also at their ability to embody the essence of the characters. The result was a cast that seamlessly gelled together, creating a dynamic on-screen family that resonated with the audience. As Empty Nest unfolded, the actors and their characters became integral to the cultural phenomenon surrounding the show. The influence extended beyond the original run, inspiring adaptations and creative endeavors that enriched the Empty Nest legacy. In conclusion, the creators, producers, directors, and cast collectively crafted a TV series that left a lasting impression on the cultural landscape. Their collaborative efforts birthed a show that continues to captivate audiences, showcasing the enduring appeal of Empty Nest in the world of television.
Dinah Manoff, and Christy McNichol collaborated as teenagers in an episode of the TV series Family titled The Sleeping Gypsy. Their professional history continued when they became cast members of Empty Nest after a significant revamp of the ensemble. Following an unsuccessful backdoor pilot, the producers decided to overhaul the cast, replacing those who initially featured in the Golden Girls' Empty Nests. The new lineup included Richard Mulligan, Dinah Manoff, Christy McNichol, Park Overall, and the memorable canine character, Bear. This reshuffling brought new life into the show and set the stage for dynamic interactions among the characters. A notable connection between McNichol and Manoff predates Empty Nest. The two actresses played friends on the Aaron Spelling Show family in 1978, forming a professional bond that later manifested on Empty Nest as they portrayed sisters. The creative minds behind the show, Susan Harris and Paul Witt, envisioned a narrative centered around a widow with pediatrician navigating life in an empty home after his daughter's departure. The collaboration between creators, producers, and the director ensured a seamless blend of humor, heartwarming moments, and unexpected twists. The cast, led by Richard Mulligan as Dr. Harry Weston, alongside Christy McNichol and Dinah Manoff as his daughters, played pivotal roles in bringing the characters to life. The meticulous selection of actors considered not only their acting skills, but also their ability to embody the essence of the characters. The result was a cohesive cast that authentically portrayed the Weston family dynamics, captivating the audience throughout the series. As the show unfolded, the actors and their characters became integral to the cultural phenomenon surrounding it. The influence extended beyond the original run, inspiring adaptations and creative endeavors that enriched the show's impact in the world of television. The chemistry among the cast members and the relatable family narrative contributed to the show's lasting appeal in the world of television. In 2014, David Rash reprised his role as Jack Trenton in the film Amira and Sam. This venture showcased the versatility of his character beyond the original TV series. To anticipate potential departures, the producers strategically introduced Emily as an off-screen character. This move aimed to have an established third sister available as a replacement, showcasing the foresight in managing the ensemble cast dynamics. During breaks in production, Rue McClanahan revealed that Park overall would spend her downtime roller skating in the parking lot. This behind-the-scenes tidbit sheds light on the cast's camaraderie and how they spent their off-screen moments. These glimpses into the actors' post-series careers and the strategic planning for the ensemble cast add layers to the narrative surrounding Empty Nest. Such insights offer a nuanced understanding of the show's evolution and the dynamics that contributed to its enduring popularity.